Why did it has to be Joe Biden? The answer is simple. The Economist, the Illuminatis magazines answer it. The Illuminatis don't want Trump. This is a few people supporting Biden and billions supporting Donald Trump. Here we have Eric Trump. We have them on video, certain ones wearing literally Biden-Harris face masks in polling locations, which is totally legal. And now they won't let, and we brought one great gentleman here with us today, Jeremy, who's a poll watcher. <laughs> let him watch as they count the ballots. They put them behind a fence, 40, 50 yards away, where they actually can't see the counting happening. Guys, this is fraud. This is absolute fraud. We've seen it in Philadelphia before. They're trying to make a mockery of the election of this country. My father is up by almost half a million votes in this state with 86% reported and plenty of red counties left to go. Plenty of red counties left to go. We're going to win Pennsylvania, but they're trying to cheat us out of it because they know it's their only path to victory. They know it's the only path to victory. And so we came here today. We met with all our lawyers. Uh, we are going to file suit in Pennsylvania. It's a shame that we have to do that. It's the last thing that we wanted to do. It's the last thing my father wanted to do. But this is rampant corruption, and it can't happen. It simply can't happen. It's not fair. This isn't democracy. And with that, I want to pass it off to the great Rudy Giuliani, who's really leading the legal effort. And uh, you'll be hearing from, uh, from Rudy quite a bit. Please. Thank you very much, Eric. It, it, is, it is very, very sad that we're here in the city that's uh, really the birthplace of our democracy. And this is among one of the most anti-democratic things I've ever seen or encountered. And it's not just here in, 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 Phil in Philadelphia. This is going on all over the country. Uh, we have filed a lawsuit. The lawsuit actually required that when these mail-in ballots that you know are highly suspicious anyway, this form of balloting has always been considered the most prone to fraud. That's according to the New York Times when it didn't apply to candidate President Trump. Well, we were supposed to be allowed by law to observe the counting of the ballots. Now, observe means to any intelligent person being able to look at it. The way it's interpreted by the Democrat crooked machine of Philadelphia is that the observers can be 20 or 30 feet away, never able to see the ballot itself, never able to see if it was properly postmarked, properly addressed, properly signed on the outside. All the things that often lead to disqualification of ballots or make it very easy to dump 50,000 totally fraudulent ballots because they're not observed. This went on for 20 hours, while all of you thought there was some kind of legitimate count going on here in Philadelphia. It was totally illegitimate. So we went back to court, and we went before a Democrat judge. No need to tell you what the result in Philadelphia is if you're before a Democrat judge. Obviously a political hack who doesn't know the meaning of the word observe. Observe means to be able to look. Not a single Republican has been able to look at any one of these mail ballots. It is fraud, it is illegal, and it is anti-democratic. The Illuminatis fear smart people, intelligent people, and I am here standing because I defeat them. And we, the intelligent people, are more than them. So you are not going to cheat us. My pleasure. Be careful.